What is that, man? Give me a break. No! Come on. See, look at that. This might be the worst motocross game ever made. Uh, worst MXGP game ever made. At least that's what my opinion was on it before coming to this video. So, uh, we'll just see what the, the game feels like and plays like. I'm not going into a season mode. Fuck. I did not mean to click on that. I'm not racing at Naquan. Get out of here. Quick modes. That's what we wanted. Grand Prix. Uh, new. What track do we want to ride on? I am not sure. I know the custom track editor in this game wasn't very good. So, uh, probably not going to ride uh, one of these. Let's just go back to official. I, c I couldn't tell you which track's good in this game. Mantova is always a nice one. So we're going to rock with Clement de Salle. Here is the race options. Uh, single race, clear. Everything's on the hardest difficulty because I am a god. Let's just uh, see how this goes. The one thing I actually do enjoy about this game is the presentation, the menu, the music. It's all very good in this game. But as we know, the gameplay is what matters. So let's pick a gate. Probably the last gate selection. Yeah. All right. One thing I did notice about this game is that the AI is actually decent, at least on the one track I would raced on. The bike sounds are a bit iffy, the rev limiters. Okay. <laughs> one thing you might no oh come on man, give me some space. One thing you might notice is that you don't really get too much air on this game. The bike seems to stick to the track, but at the same time it's very slippery. AI is fucking insane, they're all over the place. Let's see how the whips look. I think the animation could look a bit better if the rider didn't go... Alright. The whip animation could look better if the rider wasn't a bit goofy. See, now we're in a pickle, I was kind of fucking around. But now this is where it gets hard because the AI actually can pull away pretty easily. You can actually move the AI out of the way, unlike in the new Supercross games. Uh, the one thing I don't like about this game, there is no ruts, no berms, so it's a very slippery game and there's really no line choice. Nice. Let's dive up the inside. Come on! I dive up the inside and that's what happens. I'm in fucking last place, just where I started. Holy shit. I thought I was going to be doing better than this. But yeah, the AI is actually not bad in this game. That's the one reason why I played it for at least a few weeks when it came out. Cut off patch rail? Nope. Yeah, there is just no traction. No traction. The rider looks a bit goofy in this game. Here we go, squeeze him out. Fucking drift simulator. I think I made a video on this game like three, four years ago on my when I first started making videos and piss off. Holy fuck, we're miles behind, man. We are not winning this race. I will do one more race where I'll actually will fucking try a bit harder at the start. Because once you go down in this game on the start, you put yourself in a bad position because the AI is not easy to pass. They often get in your lines and your way, which is kind of nice. Let's block him. We'll see, he reacted. That's good. I typically prefer MX... Look at the traction he's got. I typically prefer MXGP games over Supercross games. So I honestly might rather play this than Supercross 5 or 4. Uh, it, it's really... They're, they're all bad games. I'm not enjoying the uh, physics. The, it's way too slippery. What is that, man? Give me a break. Fucking dead last again. Like, there should be an inside berm right here like there is on MXGP 20 and 21. Look at this. Me and Libra are rocking. We're representing Monster Energy very well here. Oh, my God. See? Ah! Take him out. Get out of here, man. Look at the back end. Let's test out first person. I think it's... I don't like it. It's very, like, rigid. And when you turn, it follows with the bike very weirdly. 
And the back end's everywhere in this fucking game, so you can't tell what you're doing. Let's get out of that shit. Not a good first person. The graphics are alright, like the, the texture on the track, it's alright. Better than the new Supercross games. Oh, that was a nice little shot. I think this is the first MXGP game where you can actually join official teams, if I'm not mistaken. So that's actually a nice bonus. <laughs> I'm in 21st. Fuck, he pushed me wide. See that? AI is actually a little bit strategic in this game. The back, the wheels move a little bit too slow on the bike. If you, once you notice it, you can't unnotice it. Oh my god. I'm so bad. I think I could have fun with this game because I enjoyed the MXGP stuff, but... The tracks just aren't built well. There's no deformation. Well, there is, but you can't feel it. Okay, here we go. Last lap. Let's see if we can crack the top 15. Let's get a... In front of Paul in here. He did a nice cut on her move. Oh, no, I stayed nice and low there. Got the inside of Sewer. I think there is a couple spots where your bike hooks into something, but it just slides out of it. Look at the sliding, man. Every corner you have to slide the back end around, like you're drifting. It's Drift Simulator. I remember saying that in my video I made on this game years ago. When it came out, I remember saying that shit. It's Drift Simulator. Alright, 13th. You know, not amazing. Could do better. Let's go to another track and uh, let's get the fucking win. This game actually has a podium celebration. Nice. I know they took it out in the last couple of MXGP games. We're level two. Nice, dude. Nice. This time I think I'm gonna do better. Where do they get their speed from? Hello? I'll get around the outside. Alright, that's a better start, boys. That's a much better start. Yeah, the bike sounds suck in this game. What the hell? Whatever. No, you just... Oh. I thought he was taking me out. Whoa! This track compared to the one in MXGP3, uh... It's a lot better in MXGP3. <laughs> Graphically-wise and the way it's built. It feels very flat in this game and uninspiring. Nice little whip glitch there, boys. Like, look at that! <laughs> oh, the physics suck in this game. Yeah, they're still on my ass. See, the AI is not easy to pull away from. Especially since I'm not very good at this game. The off-camera corners feel horrible. They're doing a lot of milestone games. Alright, Anstey's still on her ass. Oh, come on, man. Come on, Hurlings. I'm actually having a little bit of fun because the AI is putting pressure on me. I'm not just pulling away by 30 seconds in a lap while crashing 10 times. If you crash a couple times in this game, you're probably not going to win. At least on a quick race. Oh, this camera's way too far away. Whoa. I'll oh, get out of that. Let's, do, let's go in first person. Why not? Okay, I'm getting out of first person because he's going to pass me. Like, the bike sounds are just not revving very high. It sounds like they're bogging often and very bland. Me and Nancy are kind of pulling away here. Nice little whip. Yeah, I think this game probably has the worst physics out of any MXGP game. I just... There's something off with them, man. The game's a bit too slippery. If this game had MXGP 20's physics, it would be much better. Much better. No! Come on! See, look at that. Went down once, now I gotta fucking... I gotta do some nasty shit to get back in first. Zansty is probably going to pull away. Turn, man! 
Fuck, he's gapping me, man. He's straight gapping my cheeks. Little cheetah line there, why not? Oh, here we go. We caught him. Let's get him. Let's get him. Nice. Yo, this is actually kind of fun. I'm having a good battle. I don't even want to try racing a 250. It's going to feel so slow. All right, last lap. I'm looking at the radar way too much because I can see Anstey's fucking white dot right behind me. He's scaring me, dude. Get off me. <laughs> Get away. If he takes me out, I will probably shit. Been eating a lot of protein lately. So, uh. Yeah, and Steve, if, if you come near me, I'm gonna shit. Got a bit of a gap. Here we go. Let's let's go a little wide this time. How do you bog in first to gear? How is that possible? You can't really get the back end up in this game. It feels off. Gosh, he's there. They're all there. They're coming for me, boys. Alright, don't slide out here. Nice and easy. Good shit. Oh my god. I'm all over the place. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright, last corner. Or second last corner. I think we got this, boys. It's nice and easy. Nice and easy hurlings. There we go. See, th this game this game can be fun with AI. I will give it that. Am I going to continue playing it after this video? Probably not. But, uh, yeah, there you go. Got the dub, as you can see. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, maybe the next one, it'll be MXGP 2020 or another MXGP game. So, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. And take care.